pull up, reload, rewind, selector. Let Man can't chat no shit in my sector. None. You can't run gums round here. What you mean? What you mean? Like Skepta. You mean? The doctor man. genius to think. Mm-hmm. Yeah, he's a musical yeah. genius for sure, man. Yeah. That's what he, he wants to do with Death Row, but didn't work out, man. Came on board, Shug just because Shug was supposed to play the back, but once Pac came on board, Pac energy, Shug just took to that. Mm-hmm. He started doing what what Puff was doing, what he he said he wouldn't do. Mm. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. He was on a hype. Yeah, it's a fact. He was on a hype, yeah. bro. He liked One Tupac, team and Tupac so looked, linked up. It was mad, bro. They he loved was Tupac. Beating up everyone, bro. Everybody yeah. loved Tupac. It was getting, everyone was getting terrorized, bro. Ooh, that's. <laughs> it was hanging vanilla rice off of balconies by his feet. Allegedly, oh, word. Yeah, you hear that yeah. shit? It was. It was Even vanilla rice bro. was like, yo, they came to my apartment, you know? Matter of <laughs> fact, I'm lying. He on some. Oh. He just kept showing up. Because <laughs> I was acting. <laughs> he would come to my dinner. I was eating at a $2,000 restaurant. And he'd come, how you doing? Very polite. Fair. He just kept showing up and showing up. <laughs> One day, I'm back in my hotel. I, I walk in. And he he turned the, the people, basically, but it's a TV show. Yeah. yeah, yeah. But he tells the people, basically. Shook Knight was a terrorist, bro. Yeah, Shook Knight, Jesus. <laughs> Even you don't believe it, because it's like, you couldn't have been doing Even this. Even Tony Ayo said they was filming in the club video in LA. And then fucking dude said that dude come in like, Shook's here. And everyone ran out and left. And they're like, we ain't running nowhere. We're G with you in it, bro. And then Tony Ayo said it's the first time that he saw Mexicans with tattoos on their faces running. And he was like, oh shit. Yo, you know what I mean? Shook was just running crazy just to just to come and roll up to, to show his presence. Mm-hmm. Do you know what I'm saying? Nah, I respect Shook for that though, man. Because when you want to get the job done, you got to get the job done, so. Nah, yeah, he was by like any means. He was like, was like a long means. J Prince. Like, that's what I like about him, though. Like, I never really knew the, the whole J Prince thing, bro. Maybe, Maybe you could break it down for me, bro, because I never really get it. I didn't know where his credibility came from in terms of. All right. Because people respect him, man. Basically. I didn't know too much about him, bro. He's basically like a Diddy, a Shug. You know, came from the streets. Well, did he? He ain't come from the streets did directly, he yeah, but did his he family, connected. yeah, he connected. And all yeah, that. Yeah, so he yeah, came from you, you, You've given that. Yeah, he came from Harlem. But bro, yo, if we, I know, uh, yo, I'm drinking and shit. But if you want to, Diddy, I saw the do- this new documentary, bro, on YouTube, and it's about Baby D, the Crip dudes. Yeah, you see that, that shit, killed, bro. That 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 um that allegedly killed, killed Tupac. Tupac, Tupac, no, Tupac, 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 Tupac. Basically, Fit Biggie and, and Diddy, this is where it fucked me up because I thought that... The death row Because I remember, I remember the King Tut and the, the what's his name? Um, what's it? Haitian Jack from New York. Mm-hmm. Yeah, Haitian Jack from New York. But mm-hmm. when I see that Diddy had hired like some crypt dudes that his uncle knew from Crenshaw or something or Compton to roll with them when they do West Coast shows, they was basically like... South group, they, yeah, they was grouping... They, yeah, Southside Crypts. They was basically grouping up people that Tupac didn't get on with to ride with him anyway. So it was always going to mm-hmm. be nuts. Mm-hmm. Because that's when Tupac rushed the guy in the, in the, in the Vegas. Yeah, well, you know what's funny? Mm-hmm. Tupac oh, okay. never had no real beef with Biggie. He even said it. Nah, they didn't. Biggie, they they could have patched up if they, they were right. Yeah. He never yeah. wanted to hurt Biggie. He just mm-hmm. wanted to destroy him. Meaning, it was Music. a power thing. Yeah, yeah like, mm-hmm. he could you, th- you think Pac couldn't have pressed the button and said, yo, sugar? Go do a big deal. Nigga, Shook probably was putting in his ear like, yo, but Pac probably trying to go nigga. That's nah, not the plan. Yeah, it's it's like cool. I'm just trying to deal with him on like on TV and humiliate him, <clears> man. <throat> yeah, yeah, that's but a fact. But I think he would make some dumb shit like hit him up. Even he said like afterwards, like, yo, I regret making that. Might be top five diss track, though. That's top one. But well, now Aoife might be above that, you know, bro. No, 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 no. Let me take some. Mm-hmm. Let, let, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. No, 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 look. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Ether was vicious, man. No, 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 no. Yeah. Look, look, look. Ether time, could definitely time. be two. <laughs> What's that? Ether could definitely the be two. The chicken fat in the back. <laughs> Ether could be two. Joseph. Right after. Shut him up, man. Right, but. Yeah, right after hit him up. It's close, man. I promise you, bro. But, nah. You know why? I know, that, nah, Jigga now, lasted in the long run. Let me I get that, show but. you how I'm gonna just finish your whole argument right now. <laughs> no, let me talk to him. Let me talk to him. Where eat the video at? <laughs> huh? <laughs> Let's just say both of them is the same. All right. Where is eat the video? That's what Nas would never do. 
Nobody nah, would it. ever do that. Nah, no, you know what I'm saying? Like, uh-huh. Tupac is crazy. Yeah. Well, yeah, he was a mad, he was, he was a madman. RP, but like, not just nothing like. No, he was like, he's he's crazy. Like, he, he was in like, my opinion, he was like, like one of the smartest men that you could probably find at that age, but with just bad decision making. Yeah, 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 man. Like, yeah, yeah. that's my Yo, opinion. He, he, yeah. he, he made me. He made irrational decisions, fam. Mm-hmm. But what? With, oh, he's here. Word, we gonna fuck him up now. Nah. Mm-hmm. Forgetting that you got a platinum album. Yeah, famous, yeah he, shot. he was too. He died, um, he died last year. Spontaneous. Yeah, bro. He was. He was. He was alive. Well, like, that, that's D, that, that's DMX too, though. And he was too regular. And wow, that's crazy. Like they too regular for their own good. Mm-hmm. Meaning, like niggas would they have the block. They're off the block. Five yeah. million dollars. But it's like, yo, I don't care about. Like, yeah. certain, people yeah. just, certain people just know they got money. Okay, yeah. Yeah, yeah it's there. Let me go and drive airplanes. DMX, like, yeah, yeah, shit, yeah. Like, <laughs> like, flying airplanes and the well, twins, the twins. twins. Yeah. Why, while he on the set with Big Moves, Start Jelly. They made him wait a whole time. Like, they don't care about all that. I saw that shit. They, the, they said that he had to wait. They had to wait a whole day. They had to pause a whole day of shooting the movie because he said he didn't feel like shooting. He wanted to fly his plane, bro. Yeah. He just made the whole Hollywood stop for the day. Exactly. All the crew had to, and yeah, then there's the Ja Rule story where he stole the car. You see that? Yeah, and he yeah. picked up Ja Rule. <laughs> yeah. You heard about the one with with, with um, Nori that he had on nah, his podcast? Nori fell asleep in the, the drink. Yeah, <laughs> 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 nah, what, what happened? What happened? <laughs> <laughs> he said that he said that Nori he tried to get for days, bro. Just to, just to get a two pack. I mean, a DMX verse, basically. CNN basically um thing of Nori, right? They go to LA to get a verse from DMX. They telling Def Jam, yeah, just pay for it. One weekend, it's two, two days. They telling them, yo, because DMX on Def Jam. Yeah, the, man- the manager said to them, yeah, nah, I'm getting a song, you know. <laughs> two days with X. <laughs> they ignore your hood nigga, like, you know, nah, what are you talking about? I can go out there. We, we, yeah, we get that done. We're gonna bang it out and he's back. <laughs> nigga, know he said he in LA chasing, trying to find DMX for like two, three days. Bro, this Find is- DMX. <laughs> okay, good. Go to the studio, right? <laughs> Alright, go to the studio, yeah. No, do you know what the funniest part is? You're gonna miss it. I can tell, listen, the funniest part is that he's in the bar, then they go to like the club and they go here and they're rolling with him to kind of like get him ready to do the song, like, yeah, we're hanging out so we can feel each other. <laughs> because, no, because you know what rappers are, like, they they want to know, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah But then um, they leave the club in the morning and he's like, yo, we need to get in the studio and do the joint. And they leave in the club drunk. And then there's some kid, random kid that to, that DM, sorry, DMX knows. He's like, yo, we're up, no, so, we And then they don't even know him. And then the guy's like, oh yeah, I've got a studio. And he's like, yo, Nori! Yo, Nori, see, look, we got a studio. And Nori's like, bro, we've been had a studio. Mind you, Nori. Know, you didn't even know, you know what I mean? Nori got them damn booking out <laughs> big studios, you know what I mean? Say, that's what I'm saying, DMX uh, didn't even. I'm Nori. He's enough, I got he's a man, man. Booked out. I'm telling them they have booked Beasy for two days. <laughs> two days gone, I'm still chasing DMX. Tell them they have booked these for the next <laughs> And they, they tried to do something like regular Joe Shield. Walk fast, explode, his man come out. So you got a studio in the script. Yo, Nori, <laughs> mind you, we got a way to be easy. Yo, Nori. He's like, yo, Nori, that's crazy. <laughs> yo, right We've been looking for a studio. Oh. Mind you, they did the song oh. in the homie studio. Oh, yeah, they did the same. Yeah, they look in the studio, bro. Yeah, still baby. That's how real it is. <laughs> so, then, so basically, DMX is rapping his verse in the booth, and Nori's smoking his spliff, waiting, and then he just stops. Oh, shit. And then, and then he just stops rapping, bro. Oh, shit. <laughs> DMX shit. rapping like eight bars. And then no more. Nori like, oh, yeah, it's literally the first <laughs> nigga we hit, dog. All right? You just get. It's quiet. <laughs> They go in the booth, on the floor. Sleeping, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Yo. And then, and then apparently, the, apparently his guy was like, no, wake that dog everybody. up, bro. This is where I would slap everybody in the room. <laughs> his man's in there, DMX man. Don't wake the dog, man. <laughs> 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 <laughs>